Hello and welcome back to Resident Evil HD Remaster, where today we are on a quest to get death masks, because we do need three more of those. Considering we've only got one so far. And we're going to use the supplies that Wesker so kindly gave us in pursuit of said masks. Ooh, can we open this now? Yes, we can. I wish I remembered the sequence to push these guys in. But let's try... Sword! And then shield. And then axe. Nope. Then sword again. Then shield again. Then halberd. Then sword again. Oh. So sword needs to be first, absolutely. Because it pushes all three others out. But halberd pushes sword out. So maybe sword needs to be last, and then it won't push things out? Oh. Sword goes in with shield. Okay. as if you failed indeed. So how about we boop this and then boop this. Oh, we just needed the heart, huh? Well, that's one of three. Excuse me, sir. Didn't mean to disturb you. Another one of the three will be through there. We're just not ready for it yet. for is through here. This is a helmet key, right? Yeah. And it's about time for us to create another entire hallway full of zombies. Thankfully, it's one we won't cross again until after the zombies are replaced with hunters, I guess.
which incidentally isn't much better. So, yeah, pump the water. We'll pump it to red. That's exactly where we want it. So, chemical to use on plants. And they're dead. I wish I had space to grab one of those herbs. But I don't. So if we end up needing healing, we might come back before it's hunter time, but... We might end up losing just as much health getting here. Yes, hello, fellas. Thankfully, those guys are completely non-threatening. At least on the first trip through. If you don't get startled and stop moving, then there's not much they can do to you. I'm going to go put in the three death masks I have right now. Just so that I can more easily bring more stuff to fight the uh, Crimson Head Elder later on. Because not needing to have these in my inventory would be helpful. Uh, you know what? I think one of the zombies who just crashed in through the window will be between us and the door that I want to take right now. Or we could just get grabbed right there. Jerk. Yep, he was between us and that door, but he didn't get us. So we should just be at yellow caution. Really, I should have just gone upstairs. That way I wouldn't have had to go past either of them. Could have saved myself some damage. Excuse me, sir. Oh, dang it. Between the camera and the terrain, I got funneled right into his arms. Yeah, that one's got no eyes. This one's got no eyes. This one's got no anything. And this one's got no anything. Someone needs to clean off the camera. This one's got no nose, which we don't have. So this one, nope, we don't give it a shotgun. So since we're at danger, we actually need to get past both of these zombies without taking a hit. Which might be tricky, considering I can't see them. But it sounds like they're right there. Okay, there's one. No! No, 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 no! Well, dang. 
So, just lost everything we did so far this episode, but it's not actually that much, and we can probably do better. So it's not terrible. It's just ten minutes. Ten minutes and some PS4 menu stuff. Now, if this load screen wasn't here, we'd be more easily able to read that text. Of course, we still get plenty of time for it. All right, let's equip that, and we got to put the ink ribbon back in there. And now we know that we're not going to need an old key on the way to either of the death masks that we're going to get, so let's put it away so that we can have a green herb. Or at least bring one back out from where we killed the plants. And you know what? Let's go ahead and get the floor two map. Now's a decent time to do it. So we take this on over here. got a map and this is a uh, helmet door right yep good. Finding more armor doors is very good. Because being able to get rid of the armor key frees up a slot, and I like having free slots. So this time we'll go around the inner side, and that way that guy doesn't grab us. Okay, so axe. And then halberd. And then axe again. So halberd, axe, shield is the order. Got it. this side of the heart and then this side of the heart and we get our death mask and then we'll unlock this door and then we continue on. Where else do we need the armor key? Hmm. Oh, you know what? 
believe we need it right here. There we go. Now we could go out there, but I don't recall there being much reason to as Chris. Simply because Chris can't get a grenade launcher, if memory serves. But I mean, they probably put something else there in place of the grenade launcher. There's no way it's a path that just exists for its own sake. Because that would be silly. jerks. And now we put the chemical in here. And then we turn it to red. slightly faster if you put the chemical in first and then turn the thing. I just did it the other way because my memory wasn't perfect. And if there's a chance that you can blow it, well then there's a chance I'm not willing to take. You know what? Let's take as many of these as we can so that we never have any desire to come back. And unfortunately, since this isn't Resident Evil Zero, we can't combine something as we pick it up. Which means that we cannot grab that last herb. Would have been able to if I did it before grabbing the death mask, but I didn't think to do that. So we are once more going to try to get all our death masks where they belong. Just because, again, getting them out of our inventory is good and that way we only have one full slot when we go to fight the Crimson Head Elder. So we've got full freedom to do whatever we want with the other five slots instead of needing to bring four things and thus only having full freedom on two slots. Because having more slots that you can use for whatever you want tends to be better. This time, we're not going to slide right into this zombie's arms. Skip that little 
like this and that. But alas, we cannot. But if nothing else, we now are uh, three masks lighter. And since we've got an herb and haven't taken damage, I'm willing to brave these guys on the way out. Especially since only one of them managed to do anything. Oh, that was worth coming over here for. If it was just handgun ammo, I would have been a little upset, but shotgun shells, that's worth the risk. So we're at yellow caution, so we're pretty all right. Let's check just what they put in here. Because again, it's got to be something. It was birds. So, two green herbs. That's what they put here. Okay, he was too far for that second blast, and that's actually a waste of shotgun ammo, because... We're not coming back here. Ooh, ouch. The music is still playing, which tells me he's still alive. He didn't have anything on him, did he? Nope. He was just protecting two herbs. And yet we haven't gotten everything there is to get in this area, so I guess a more thorough search is in order. Nothing down that way. So I guess he was just protecting the herbs. But maybe where he came from? Nope, nothing here. A dagger. Is a dagger the only other thing? Yep. A lot of ammo down the drain for just two herbs. Really shouldn't have come in here. I was hoping that maybe he'd like drop a key or something. But no. All right, where can we go now? Unless we can find Becky, we can't get the helmet key. But we need the helmet key to go fight Yawn. But we can check the rooms in front of where Yawn is. And maybe we'll find something. Maybe that's the key to finding Becky. Yeah, I do believe so. Yep, hi Becky. You. Chris Redfield, Alpha Team. We're here to rescue you. Richard, 
What the hell happened to you? Chris, this place... Get your team out of here. Demons... everywhere. Don't talk. He seems to have been bitten by a poisonous snake. But the size of the bite mark is huge. It's not just any ordinary snake. <laughs> Take my word for it. He needs serum. I left it in another room. I'll go get it. Please hurry. Hold on. I'll be back. And she needs not just any serum. She needs all caps serum. Yeah, I know where it is. <laughs> Hooray for sneezes. stop, but unfortunately it's not something I'm in control of. <coughs> Just really needed to check that zombie again. Or rather, that body. Okay, serum. Yes, please. And let's actually use one of these. Though it actually been, it would have been more efficient to wait until he took one more hit, then combine them and use them. But oh well. We've still got access to enough healing items that efficiency isn't what we need to be worrying about just yet. This isn't Resident Evil Zero. Guys, I got the serum. Hope this is what you wanted. Thank you. I'm gonna give you a shot now, Richard. Hang in there. Here. Take it. It's a radio. Take care of yourself, Rebecca. Richard. He's okay. He's just unconscious. Rebecca, it's not safe here. Let's get Richard to a safer place. Right. Richard's doing well, Chris. He should recover soon. Good. Richard needs you now. As soon as Richard gets better, we'll come after you. Rebecca, you okay with the gun? Yes. All right. I'm going to continue my investigation. Be careful. Okay? Yeah, I should think after Resident Evil Zero's events, she should be pretty okay with a gun. Alright, so now we've found Becky. But let's go back to the areas in front of Yawn. Because I believe there's some stuff we probably need from around there. Could be wrong. But we'll check anyway.
Oh, hey. Where'd you come from? Good thing you weren't here when we were trying to help Richard. Oh, hi. Um, do I shoot? Uh, I guess I should have. But hey, we got by without using our dagger. Cost us a little health, but that's fine. Okay. So now we can light this room up. Oh no. Well, that worked. And it worked well. Oh, hi. No, I didn't want to run right back in. from here. Wait, seriously? We're not scoring hits? I was really just hoping that we'd get a critical headshot so I could get my knife back, but oh well. worth a few bullets to try and save a knife because a knife can save you some damage and this is a helmet door or shield door right the only shield door excuse me sir and no, let's let's do that. And then we'll take this and we'll combine it. And we'll leave that one there for later. We might end up wanting it on our way in to fight Yon. Let's actually go find out just how bad Chris is at piano. Because after all, we need that piano played before we can get our next key. someone pushed this thing back. Like Moonlight Sonata. No, it didn't. 
Can you play? What was that? My interpretation is off a little. Let me practice for a while. Sure. But don't get too carried away. Oh, I won't. She was better than you, Chris. I forget how long we need to let this go on. And also whether or not we have to be in the room for it. I don't think we do. The real question is, why did she suddenly show up here? Did she hear how bad Chris was from all the way over in the save room? Uh-oh. You know... I kind of want to go through there to get to the save room more efficiently. But, alas, I can't, er, yes I can, apparently. Now, will there be a zombie just waiting to grab me? Apparently not. Um, this isn't where I meant to go, but it'll at least reset the zombie's positions. This guy was going to bite us no matter what. wonder what determines whether they bite you once or three times. Is it their clothing? That's not... Or no, that's just a two-herb mix. Sure. So if two herbs is enough to get you from danger to fine, what's the point of three? You doing okay, Richard? Yeah, you seem fine. Grab this ink ribbon. Let's. Whoop. Wrong file. Though there's not much reason not to overwrite that one. Uh, yeah. Hopefully by the time we get back to Becky, she'll be done practicing. But that's going to be it for this episode. Join us next time when hopefully Becky will be done practicing. See you then, friends. <laughs>